is a scary hadith but I need to mention it because we have young brothers and old brothers and we're all in need of guidance. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam mentions this hadith in the narrator's Thawban radiallahu an. The Rasul says, min ummati. I know people from my ummah, from the Muslims. يَأْتُونَ يَوْمَ الْقِيَامَةِ بِحَسَنَاتٍ أمثال جبال تهامة بيضاء. They will come in the day of judgment with good deeds the size of mountains glowing bright. So the Rasul says, فيجعلها الله هباء منثورا. And yet Allah رب العزة will make it disappear like husks of rice. You know, it just blows away in the wind. هباء منثورا. All their deeds will disappear. So the Sahabi asks, Ya Rasul, describe them to us so we don't do what they do. So the Rasul said, Ama innahum min ikhwanikum. They are from your brothers. Wa min jildatikum. And from your tribesmen. And they're not ordinary Muslims. Wa ya'khuzoon min al-layli kama ta'khuzoon. They are people who wake up in the middle of the night and pray as you pray. But what is the problem? But they are people when in seclusion, they transgress against the limits of Allah. Rabbul Think Muslim when he and she is alone in a room and there's a screen and a laptop and a computer and a phone, they transgress against the limits and boundaries of Allah Rabbul The poem says it beautifully. If my Lord were to ask me, did you have no shame from me? Did you have no shame in disobeying me? And you kept your sin hidden from my creation. And you came with your sins to me. You're afraid of a cat coming into your room, but you are not afraid that I was watching. So if your sin, listen to me Muslims, because I need to clarify this. If the sin in seclusion happens out of weakness and out of a slip, and it is not jurra against Allah Rabbul Izzah, that is an ordinary sin. But if you sin, recognizing in a way that the Lord is watching, and yet you still don't care and persist, then you have fallen in courage against Allah Rabbul Izzah, and then Allah will delete the deed. So my dear brothers, as was the condition of our predecessors, concentrate in my Allah Rabbul Izzah, grant me and you tawfiq. Not only on doing the deed and my Allah grant you the capacity to do a lot of khair, but concentrate on the deed being accepted after it is done and my Allah Rabbul Izzah accept from me and from you.